Hello everybody, my name is Sarah and I'm Mrs. Hazel's daughter. Now today I'll be reading you one, two, three hoops. Mr. and Mrs. Rabbit had a big family, a very big family, a very, very big fam family. I wonder how many babies we've got said Mr. Rabbit one morning. I think I'll count them. Why not wait till later, said Mrs. Rabbit. I would. No, said Mr. Rabbit firmly. I'll do it now. So outside he went to where the babies were playing. Mr. Rabbit started counting. One, two, three. Oops! Nogging, splogging, he ex exclaimed. With a hop and a skip, the babies he'd counted ran off to join their brothers and sisters. He couldn't tell which one he counted and which one he hadn't. Mr. Rabbit started again. This time he got a little further. One, two, three, four. Oh, no! Nogging, splogging. Boodle doodle, he grumbled. The babies had started a game of tag and mood. He lost count again. Mr. Rabbit tried one more time. One, two, three, four. Oops! Oh, nogging, splogging, boodle doodle, grizzly whistly, he groaned. Now, now the babies had started playing hide and seek and he couldn't see any of them. He'd lost count again. This is no good, said Mr Rabbit. I'll have to think of a better way. So he sat and thought until he had a good idea. I know, he said. I'll give a carrot to every baby. I count. That way, I'll be able to see the ones I've counted and the ones I've missed. So, Mr. Rabbit started again. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oops, oh, nogging, splogging, boodle, doodle, grizzly, whizzly, sniffy, whiffy. He cried. The babies he'd given a carrot to had eaten them. He couldn't tell who he counted and who he hadn't. I know, said Mr. Rabbit, as he had another good idea. I'll tell them to sit down when I've counted them. That way I won't get mixed up. So, Mr. Rabbit told his babies to sit down once he's counted them. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven. Oops! Oh, nogging, splogging, boodle, doodle, grizzly, whizzly, sniffy, whiffy, jingle, bingle, he shouted. The ground was full of prickly weeds. Just as soon as he counted them, the babies jumped up. Again, Mr. Rabbit had lost count once more. Right, this will definitely work, said Mr. Rabbit, as he had another good idea. I'll send every baby indoors. The ones still outdoors will be the ones I haven't counted. I could, couldn't possibly get muddled up that way. So, Mr. Rabbit started counting again. This time, every baby he counted was sent indoors. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oops! Oh, nogging, splogging, boodle, doodle, grizzly, whizzly, sniffy, whiffy, jingle, bingle, fuddle, duddle, yelled Mr. Rabbit, stumping his foot. 
had forgotten that the home had a back door. Every baby he'd sent in the front had run straight out the back. He'd lost count yet again. Mr. Rabbit sat down and thought one more, once more. He thought all afternoon and he thought all evening. And then he noticed a patch of mud on the ground and he had his best idea yet. I got it, said Mr. Rabbit. Every day, every time I count a baby, I'll put mud on its tail. Then I'll know the baby know that the babies with clean tails are the ones I haven't counted. I couldn't possibly get muddled that way. So Mr Rabbit began to count once more. Every time he counted the baby, he put a blob of mud on its table. tail. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oops! Oh, noggin, sploggin, boodle, doodle, grizzly, whizzly, sniffy, whiffy, jingle, bingle, fuddle, duddle, jungle, fungle. He roared and jumped up and down. It has started to rain. All the blobs of mud he put on the babies he'd counted had been washed off. He lost count yet again. I give up said Mr Rabbit. He stomped angrily back his doors. I don't know how, how to count the, those babies, he, he cried. I'm fed up. At that moment, Mr and Mrs Baby scampered back indoors, tired and happy after playing all day. They were soon fast asleep. I told you to wait till later, said Mr Rabbit. Now try counting them. Mr. Rabbit became, began counting once again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. He cried, I've done it. Oh, no, you haven't, said Mr. Rabbit. You've forgotten the little one. Oh, no. Oh, look at that. Hope you enjoyed the story and hopefully I'll read to you again soon. Bye.